In this video, we are going to discuss about radio waves, another unguided media used to transmit information. Transmission of data using radio frequencies is called radio wave transmission. Now all of you must have heard music, music programs or talk shows on your radio sets. What happens essential there is that radio stations are transmitting their programs using radio waves, using their transmitters. There is a receiver that is installed on our own radio sets and those same waves are being received by our radio sets and we are able to listen to these programs. The range of these radio waves are usually 10 miles. Now let's see what are some of the advantages of the radio waves. First and foremost, they are very inexpensive, they are very cheap. The second thing is, since they are using the air for transmission, there is no need to acquire land for their installation like it is required for the guided media like optical fiber cables or the copper wires. And last but not the least, the installation and maintenance of the devices is very cheap because they are essentially just two devices, the transmitters and the receivers. However, it has some disadvantages also. And the first and the foremost disadvantage is that it is a very insecure communication medium. Anyone, any hacker can hack into the data being transmitted using the radio waves. Second and last thing is that it is very prone to weather changes like thunderstorms or lightning. So in this video, we have learned about the radio waves. In the last few videos, we have learned about the transmission media. In our next few videos, we are going to cover the network devices that are being used to transmit data over the network. 